hey guys welcome back to the channel guys it's your inner chakras if you are new you are welcome holy spirit what do you have for the collector mm -hmm. somebody is i've been thinking i've been thinking they're thinking about that lady who are you thinking about sir holy spirit who are you thinking oh ah Somebody's thinking about something in a family room. Maybe they want to come and talk to this person in their family room. It's a wealthy man. Somebody with a little bit of something want to go talk to this, this girl here. Now, someone else is concerned. Now, this is the older man. This man looks older than the wealthy man. Now, who's concerned? We got three men here. Are they all three different men? Is someone thinking about this woman? And then we have this wealthy man here, and then we have someone who's concerned. Let's break these three men down before we go, go any further. Right, guys? Holy Spirit, clarify this man here, number 16, that's thinking about this lady. That's thinking about this lady. What is this man thinking about? Because she's definitely on his mind. What is this person thinking about, Spirit? This person is saving their money. They're being very conservative. They're being very frugal. But they also see stability with this person, right? They see progress with this person. They can see power with this person. Foundations with this person. Holy Spirit, clarify this family room. So somebody can see themselves with somebody, right? What's in this family room? It's going to go down in the family room. Persuasion. Persuasion is going to go down in this family room. Influence. Passion. Power, strength, and control. Something's going down in the family room. Somebody wants to talk. Holy Spirit, clarify this wealthy man. This wealthy man is feeling down. They're depressed. Wealthy man's not happy right now. Is that right, sir? Hmm. Holy Spirit, clarify this. The one that's concerned. Clarify the number 33, the concerned man. Yeah. They're dealing with a lot of delays, this person here. Indecisive, fear of sacrifice, and a lack of control. So it looks like this man here, I think it's the same man. And they're thinking about probably a lady, probably moving forward. They're thinking about this woman here, but they're indecisive. They could have things going on in their life that's preventing them from going forward. But the woman is definitely on their mind, and the wealthy man is sad. <clears throat> so they're not coming towards you right now, guys. Because this person, they have a lack of direction. They don't know. Maybe they're throwing a little arrogance. Arrogance came out twice here. Maybe they're throwing a little arrogant. Maybe they don't. I ain't going to go to her. Da, 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 da. She left me. I ain't going to go to her. This is a very domineering person, guys. Very controlling. They're very stubborn. So that's why they're thinking about you and they're not making a move. Because they're like, I want to. But they don't want to look like they folded. You know what I mean? That's how people lose a good love. Because they don't want to fold. They don't want to bend. You know? This person here, they are ready for change. They're just... They've overcommitted themselves. They're overwhelmed. And they're ready for change. They're overwhelmed. This person's exhausted. And stressed. This person is exhausted and stressed. Spirit... What's going on? Let's put some confessions on here. This person is exhausted and stressed. I do not see life without you, and that's scary. And I'm still broken. So this wealthy man is sad. Guys, you could probably be dating somebody that you don't even know is wealthy, right? And I'm not saying, like, Jay-Z rich. I'm talking about our wealthy down here, right? Our wealthy, like, let's say he makes 500000 a year because people do. 
500,000 a year times two years, that's a mil, right? It's real easy, right? Maybe it's that person. Maybe he makes 200,000 a year, 300,000 a year. Whatever his wealth is, right? Maybe he inquired his wealth. Maybe he was given the wealth, right? Whatever it is, this person said, they got a pocket full of money. You know how they always say it's lonely at the top? It's lonely at the top and they say they're still broken. And they want you, but this person is still broken for whatever reason. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. Let's see what the angels have to say. Angels, what is going on? Oh, Spirit. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. What is going on with this wealthy man? Holy Spirit, clarify this wealthy man. Six of Pentacles. The good comes back to you guys, right? This person here, they are wealthy. They have an unexpected inflow of abundance. They just do. They want to share their wealth with others. That's what this person wants to do. They want to share their wealth with others. But right now, they're being frugal. But maybe they see a balance with you, right? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. Yeah, they want balance. They want to blend the ideas of others with their own. But they know it takes self-control and patience. This person could be coming out of a marriage. Just the four wands in reverse. That's why this person is hesitating. Because now it looks like they want a new person. Yeah, they didn't follow their intuition, guys. They're trying to get to someone, or maybe this is them. Their seeds was very well planted. So their investments, they're being rewarded or something. This person just has to be patient. I guess they're finally getting rewarded for whatever they did. And that is what made them wealthy. And now they're thinking about you. Look, Queen of Swords. I think this person here, they want justice. Guys, it sounds to me, here they come, eight of cups in reverse. They walk away from something. Guys, it sounds to me that this person, just from this card here, it looks like maybe they got into something and they invested really, really well. And now they, they're they wealthy, right? Now they're wealthy, but I think they're wealthy and they're also divorced. Or they're wealthy and um, not in a connection anymore, right? They're wealthy but not stable in a connection. So I think now that they have all this extra money, they're thinking about this person here, this Queen of Swords, a very brilliant person. This person could also be in their Queen of Swords energy. This could also be divorced or unmarried. This person is releasing a situation that no longer serves them. They're walking away from something to come to you but they're still broken. Yeah, they're walking away from something to come to you. They're just still broken, Holy Spirit. Yeah, they love you. They can see the Ten of Cups with you. Mm. Let's give me one from your angels. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. So we got breathe. Archangel Raphael takes several deep breaths and exhales slowly to awaken your energy and to release old patterns. So this person has to release something, guys, to get to you. And it looks like they are. They're coming back to something. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. Peace.